truth is, mathematics goes beyond arithmetic. It is more about reasoning and logical inferences, correlating to the visible and invisible patterns. Patterns are the regularity of an entity. It is the repetition of an element in a predictable manner. These repetitions can be seen literally anywhere and everywhere, whether it be in colors, shapes, actions, or in other sequences. There is a pattern that is most evident in this world. Discovered by an Italian mathematician named Leonardo Pisano Bigolo, the Fibonacci sequence is a set of numbers that starts with a 1 or a 0, followed by a 1, then proceeds with the rule based on the rule that each number is equal to the sum of the two preceding numbers. This section introduces the basic structure of mathematical language. It covers the linguistic function of mathematics. All the mathematics and English language have many things in common in terms of structure. The rules in mathematics are stricter and some forms are more complicated. The following item summarizes some unique characteristic of mathematical language. First, it is precise because it can be stated clearly. And second, it is concise because it can be stated briefly. Third, it is more powerful because it is capable of expressing complex ideas into simpler forms. And fourth, it is not non-temporal. It has no tenses which makes it so unique as compared to other languages. And fifth, it also has vocabulary and parts of speech. Parts of speech for mathematics. Just like any ordinary language, Mathematics also has syntax and structure which can be categorized into five forms. The first, numbers, are the very first symbols that can be used to represent quantity. These are nouns in the English language. The second, operation symbols, like plus, divide, wedge, and descending wedge can act as connectives in mathematical sentences. And third, relation symbols, such as equals, less than or equal to, and tilde are used for comparison and act as verbs in mathematical language. Fourth, grouping symbols such as parentheses, braces, and brackets are used to associate groups of numbers in the operation. And fifth, variables are letters that represent quantities and act as pronouns. A mathematical expression refers to objects of interest acting as the subject in the ordinary language, a sentence which can be regarded as true or false. Since mathematics is the same all over the world, math can act as a universal language. A phrase or formula has the same meaning and comprehension, regardless of another language that accompanies it. Hence, in this way, math helps other people learn and communicate, even if other communication barriers exist. Everything in our world communicates in one way or another. There are relationships that are barely visible to the human senses. Due to the fact that we humans are born with insatiable curiosity, we have built tools to understand what, when, how, and why these beings communicate or events happen. Truth be told, the amount of theories have been proved or is being proved as the second decade in this century is expanding and supporting the way we can understand the term communication that happens almost instantaneously. Rain clouds become dark or gray instead of white when it is about to rain because of its thickness or height. That is because clouds get denser and thicker as it gathers more water droplets and ice crystals. The thicker it gets, the more light it scatters, resulting in less light penetrating all the way through it. Mathematics is evident figure in our lives. As you can see, in our lifespan or simply just our metabolic system, math is anywhere and everywhere at the same time. Nature, in connection with its natural elements, could be seen communicating together. And with that, mathematics is an evident figure that could be seen with our naked eye or without the wall.